I know this. I know this basically started out as a creek, but when you put houses up, streets up, the water doesn't go into the ground. It goes to the street, and then down into the storm sewers, and then eventually it's supposed to go down to the big storm sewer, which takes it all to the point where it empties. And about the cleanliness, I'm not sure whether it's clean or not. Sewers are what come out of your house, from your toilets, your sinks. That's unprocessed sewage. You don't want that in your water. So there's always two drainage systems in the city. The storm drain, then the sewer, which is the other stuff. Somehow, they say the pipes are broken up or hooked up so some of the sewage gets into the water. So it's not where you want to go boating or swimming. But I don't know if that's true or not. That's something that's always been a question. But I don't know if you can say for sure if it's bad water. If it's just water runoff, other fertilizer, or bird poop, you can see that around here. It shouldn't be that bad. But if it's picking up all the sewage, then yeah, it's bad. You know where it empties into? Have you seen the way the Blue River looks? See how messy and ugly that looks? The whole thing used to look like that. So you trace it all the way up to Mission Hills and all that fancy stuff and see the different creeks that add to it and form it to make it bigger than it goes down. And right in here, you know the Rock Hill Men's Club that's just now closing? It's just over there. It was set up next to Brush Creek and had 10 grass courts up and down that street. You could watch all the tennis games going on. And I think this is the story, and I don't care if you tell anyone or not, but this is probably the most underused park in the whole city. Yeah, it's got walkways, it's got beautiful grass, it's got all these things going on, but there's hardly anything in it. I couldn't go over to Loose Park and hit golf balls. These, these are fake golf balls. I mean, you couldn't do it. 